Sunday Times royal editor Roya Nikar appeared on ITV's Lorraine as she discussed Prince Charles' appearance at the Remembrance Sunday service. But Ms. Nikar noted the Prince of Wales was especially emotional at the event which also coincided with his 73rd birthday. Ms. Nikar theorized perhaps the responsibility he now has to take on following the health concerns of the Queen was catching up with him. Speaking on ITV's Lorraine, Ms. Nikar reflected on the Remembrance Sunday service which saw Prince Charles take center stage. But Ms. Nikar noted it was an especially poignant time for Charles and remarked how upset he looked. She told the program, we had, of course, the Prince of Wales who turned 73, on Sunday. We had him laying the wreath on her behalf and he looked a little bit emotional. Host Lorraine Kelly added she has never seen him looking this upset. Ms. Nikar continued, perhaps, you know, the weight of responsibility on his shoulders, he was due to fly out on an overseas tour as well yesterday which happens this week. So perhaps, you know, his mother was on his mind on his birthday but she was disappointed to miss it. But we had a lot of other royals there, the Duchess of Cambridge, the Duchess of Cornwall, the Countess of Wessex. A strong attendance which is key for the veterans who love seeing them. Prince Charles and Camilla are set to visit Jordan and Egypt this week where they will help extend Britain's soft political power in the region. The Queen pulled out from Remembrance Sunday services at the last minute with Buckingham Palace revealing the monarch was suffering from a back spray. It is yet another major event the Queen has had to skip after she did not attend COP26 and the celebrations of the Northern Ireland centenary in previous weeks. In a statement, Buckingham Palace said, the Queen, having sprained her back, has decided this morning with great regret that she will not be able to attend today's Remembrance Sunday service at the Cenotaph. Her Majesty is disappointed that she will miss the service. Prince Charles, Prince William, and Kate were in attendance with the Prince of Wales laying a wreath on his mother's behalf. Sophie Wessex also joined the royals on the balcony and was seen wiping away a tear Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, also attended and continued a tradition from Prince Philip who used to lay a wreath on the grave of the unknown soldier in the days leading up to the event.